Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are driving on Highway 2000 East West Leg. Well, we just want to give you an update on the Portmore Smart Park. Now, this park has been on the to-do list from 2011. This was when this park was announced, but they just never got started. However, this week the government actually had a groundbreaking ceremony for the construction of the Portmore Smart Park. It's going to be located across the road from the Portmore Mall on land owned by the UDC. And it's going to be 4.4 acres. It's going to be a massive park. This is the kind of progress you like to see for Jamaica, especially Portmore. As Portmore is a growing Report more is growing. It has one of the largest populations in Jamaica. So when you have this kind of park there, it will definitely help the area. So the park is going to be 21 acres. It's going to cost 4.4 billion dollars to build. These parks are not cheap. And they say it's going to finish in September 2025. But we all know. <laughs> We all know that's not going to happen. However, it will be finished. I, I'll never understand why they give these deadlines and then they're never they're, I can't remember ever hearing a deadline at the beginning of a project and that project finishing on that date. Guys, if you can remember such a project, please let us know. Maybe I'm Maybe my memory isn't very good, however, they said it's going to take 18 months. So this is very good because there were two projects. This is one and the other one is a parliament building. You're always hearing about it, hearing about it, but then haven't actually gotten started on the parliament building. So this is very good that um, they're getting this one going. Now the Prime Minister was at the groundbreaking and he said, I am happy to officially commence the build out of the highly anticipated climate smart park spanning 21 acres. He said, noting that the facility to be developed at a cost of 4.4 billion is expected to be completed within 18 months. The project, which is expected to begin on February 5th, is scheduled to be completed in September 2025. So, the, this is very good for Portmore and a lot of projects are starting in Portmore. This month, they are starting the expansion of the Grange Lane from two lanes to four lanes. And then next month, they are starting this Smart Park. So those are two massive projects. And of course, we're going to keep you guys updated on both. And Actually, all the projects in Portmore, we will keep you updated on. So, this park is intended to include several trees, running walking trails, a pond, monuments, wind turbines, observation tower, area for small indigenous animals, a public awareness component and other elements. It will also utilize green and smart technology with solar power throughout the facility. And some of the other features include sporting facilities, event spaces, commercial spaces, public restrooms. And it will also have sufficient parking and electric vehicle charging stations. It will also have a 700 meter jogging trail and that trail is to be constructed with 70% recycled materials. So this is going to be a massive structure. And they're going to have a lot of signs around the park that will give you and have interactive equipment, probably the boards you can touch and all of that, that have that will give you information about climate change, about conservation, and about recycling. 
So this is definitely a very good project and we will keep you guys updated on it. Now with all the development going on in Jamaica, prime real estate like this could have easily been sold to a developer and high rise buildings go up. So it's good that they decided to go this route and build a park. Alright guys, let us know what you think. Leave your comments in the section below. Alright guys, have a good day.